Hi, in this video we're going to be showing you an upcoming feature for the Windows Snipping Tool. So if you're used to using the Snipping Tool to take screenshots and do markups, you might like this feature. Alright, so this is not out yet, or it may be depending on when you're watching this video. Uh, this computer is a Windows Insider Edition computer, so that's why it has the update. So here's the OS build right there. So I'm not sure if you'll have to have this build or higher, so you'll find out i guess when you try it out if it's there if it's there if it's not it's not all right so how it works let's take a screenshot here first all right so normally you have your markup tools here for your pen and your highlighter eraser and shapes so this is kind of an interesting update because it's kind of like a secondary way to do something that's already built in so if you come here and you pick a square for example and you draw a square and that's your square. But if you're working with a pen, for example, and you want to do the same thing, you know, you could do this. And it's, you know, not a real square, it's just a drawn one. But if you do this again, and at the end you hold, see how it makes it a square right there? Same thing with the circle. It's going to draw your circle, connect it, and then hold like that. And you could even do like an arrow, like so, and even a straight line. Let's say you make it squiggly, but you hold the mouse, and then it makes it straight. So the key is to connect your shape and then hold the mouse button down. Because if you draw a box like this, and you let go each time before you make the next side, it's not going to do it. You have to actually hold it down the whole time, and then keep it held down till it snaps into the shape. And I believe you could even do it for an oval, too. If I could draw an oval. Like so. So, once again, you know, it's just a variation of the tool that's already there. But if you just happen to be in the drawing tool and you don't want to switch over, you could just do that. So, once again, just keep the mouse held down the whole time. Draw your shape. Connect it and keep it held down until it snaps into a shape. Alright, so once again, this is an upcoming feature of the snipping tool, depending on when you're watching this video. So you might already have this, so give it a shot and see if it works for you. Alright, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.